Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I know we've been thrashing a lot on the truck. As you can see here, that bad boy is pretty much all done. I wanna switch gears and start working on the Camaro today. You've seen from the earlier videos, this car used to have, well, as you can see, the white stripe is still on the trunk, but it did have a huge white stripe on the hood. We since then wrapped it, a bunch of other goodies on this thing. But now what I wanna do is work on the back now, get rid of the white stripes. I know a bunch of you've been commenting saying what the hell is that white stripe. And also, I don't know why Chevy did this in this years but they made daylight frames chrome when there is literally no chrome on the car even when it's factory there's no chrome so i'm gonna set and black those we're gonna take those off take the white stripe off carbon fiber wrap the spoiler and the whip there. so let's get started <music> ready for paint yet because as it's a chrome smooth finish the paint is just not going to stick on that and also if it's not super coarse in you brush it all with this it, it'll slightly scratch the surface and dull the finish which will give it something for the paint to stick to and the trick is guys after you're done using this wash it put it back in the kitchen the wife will never know so let's get started <music> inhaling all that alcohol we're ready to paint so using this rust-oleum 2x satin black just want to lay a light coat for the first coat to get some product on there the second coat will adhere to the first coat and it'll lay out pretty nice paint to dry on those bezels let's go ahead and start getting the spoiler off so we could remove that decal <music> Take this decal off. All right, guys, so we got the spoiler off, everything cleaned up. Since I got the decal off and everything, you know what? I think I am going to carbon fiber wrap this entire trunk. Let's see how that looks. If it doesn't look good, I could always take it back off. But of course, before I do that, I'm gonna have to take off these emblems or just stick on deals. Let's get them off and get to wrapping. <laughs>
product without the spoiler on it. Okay, spoiler round. So now, front has carbon fiber and the rear has carbon fiber. Pretty freaking nice. I think it came out pretty good. What do you think, guys? I was gonna wrap the spoiler carbon fiber too, but I don't know. Kinda has a good contrast with the satin with the carbon fiber, and you get a little bit of it in the back as well. Now, the only thing left to do is slap those bezels back on. Let's see how this bad boy looks. Oh, very sinister -y, huh? Yeah, that, that finished it up. black border bezels around, the carbon fiber deck lid, satin spoiler. That makes it look so much nicer. And it now matches up with everything else. I don't wanna keep going too crazy on it because we have, you know, other toys to play with. Uh, I just finished, you'll see that on a couple earlier videos I just finished EFI on that and we're gonna do a first drive test drive on that coming up very soon be sure to subscribe we got a lot more builds coming as you can see we got the 56 panel truck we're gonna do the first test drive of the EFI converted big block supercharged truck and we're gonna do a bunch of other stuff too with the Camaro and also that SS 454 truck back there too so uh, be sure to subscribe, stay tuned, but until then, I'll see you next time. Peace.